He's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? Ah, uh, yeah. What's happening to me? Or who am I? You're disoriented, Bell. We'll explain everything later. Right now, we need to help each other. We gave you a second chance where you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you are one of them. We think Percy has cut you out of the picture in Turkey. Adler found you still alive. When the plane leaves trap zone, he's stopping in Juba. This, you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duba alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. From there, we fly to Solovetsky. All right, I remember this. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. Oh. We were there. We found you after everything went down. Oh, wow. CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. Sims and I both wanted you to be CIA. You didn't resist it as much as we thought you might. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. A bigger challenge was your memory. You were put through the CIA's MK Ultra program, Bell. They gave you new memories, things constructed out of Adler's. It's fucked up. But they needed you to believe you were one of us. Okay. No. Count yourself lucky. You've only had those memories for a few months. Me? I've been living with him for over a decade. Are your hands clean, Bell? Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. Um. Enough to get us where we are today, but we're not finished yet. We have a job to do. Wow, this is so weird. Come on, we got a job to do. We got a job to do. We got a job to do. The trigger phrase kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. Bell. I realize you probably hate us right now, what we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who in the end has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. Um. This is your chance to define who you really are, Bell. Where is Perseus? From the safety. Should we tell him? Solovetsky. Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else, gear up. We're leaving now.
You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. There's still one of us. Okay. So let's see what happens now that we tell them the truth. Wow, this is like interesting and also kind of weird. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. You've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. The United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. We are hours away from Perseus detonating nuclear bombs in every major European city. We'll do whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Line to make sure the line's still there in the morning. No one's gonna brand us heroes or villains. They don't know for me, I've been chasing this ghost for 13 years. That ends now. Wow, that looks so cool, man. That looks so cool. All right, so now we'll see how this goes. We told them the truth. I'm pretty sure there's an alternate, alternate uh, ending if we told them that, you know, he was at the other place. So this is a good, you know, um, find a countdown. So this is probably the last mission. Two clicks out. All units, EMP in transit. Starfish inbound, 400 knots. When that baby hits, we'll have 12 minutes max before the radio towers come back online. Our job is to knock out the AA guns and give our warbirds a clean shot. Let's take Perseus off the air. Is that like an EMP? Whoa. As you go. Oh, I'm just shooting like crazy. I'm shooting everything. All right. We so. We survived. We gotta get the RPG guy. Alright, the RPG guy first. He's always the the guys that give you, you know, big headaches. Right, let's get these guys over here. Hopefully none of the uh the teammates walk in front of our of our uh, sights, you know huh? You know what? Because I will rage. I probably won't, but you know, it's kind of annoying when you get the friendly fire thing. Alright. Smoke. Uh, okay. We know. We're gonna push this way, though. All right, I'm gonna plant the C4 and destroy this piece of cake. Got it. Uh, okay. We got a shotgun. Adler. 
All right, so that's our job, man. Alright. Is it this way? Contact. Oh, there they are. That was a headshot. Adler keeps running in front of my do we want a shotgun? Do we want a shotgun? Oh shoot, this coming. Oh, it's one of those guys. Alright. That guy don't like headshots. Alright. Pretty good. I hope we get uh, Perseus, man. After all the stuff that we... Your power's coming back on. Adler, you seeing this? Woods, we're running out of time. I gotta tell Hudson to launch. That's a big gamble if that gun ain't clear. Watch it. Heavy empty right. on the ridge. Hudson, start your bombing run. Copy that. Get your team out of there, Adler. Those bombers won't have a chance if we don't clear that last AA gun. You better hurry the fuck up. Okay, let's go, let's move forward. Oh, so oh shoot, don't kill me, grenade. Don't kill me, grenade. Whoa. Ah uh, ha 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 ha! I'm dangerous. Whoa whoa whoa! I need to, to get my help back up. Oh, I love this gun. Oh, I'm Terminator, Robocop, all those guys at once. All right, forty-one seconds. Please do not. Adler, do not walk in front of me, man. All right, uh, let's do this. Be advised, we are scorching Earth. Clear all friendlies. Repeat, clear all friendlies. Bell, we gotta go now. We have thirty seconds, though. They did it, Mr. President. They stopped the nukes. Thank God. And the CIA. Did they get Perseus? No, sir. His whereabouts are unknown. And a Russian response? Nothing yet. We're seeing signs of confusion. It's possible this was all a rogue operation. Perseus may not have been following orders from Moscow. Well, I'll be damned. Maybe we have something in common after all. Okay. I was... We stopped him. Those towers are history. What's the situation down there? Come in. Woods, have you found them yet? Over here. Give me a hand. All right. Take my hand, Bell. We did it. This is a message to Perseus and those that'll follow him. We don't just sit back and hope for the best. We'll make the best happen. This is how wars are won, Bell. Okay. So we won? <laughs> Do you have an update on Kasim Javadi? Yeah, 
After capturing Kasim Javadi, we've convinced him he's better off working for us rather than against us. The death of Arash Kadavar opens a path for Kasim to take control of their network. He'll give us deeper insight into Soviet activity in the Middle East, and with our resources behind him, he should be able to influence regional affairs for years to come. Okay. What about Anton Volkov? Volkov has become a prime source of information since his capture. After interrogating him, MI6 quickly established a series of listening posts in East Berlin. They've already intercepted messages from the KGB to assets throughout the city. We're poking holes in the Iron Curtain. So we're learning about all the stuff that, I, that we did throughout the... How did the cleanup in Havana go? We were able to recover Agent Park's body from the compound in Cuba. President Reagan personally reached out to her family and her caskets in transit to London. We spoke in MI6. They're understandably displeased. We owe them one. Lazar Azale is recovering from his injuries in Tel Aviv. He'll return to the agency in good time. The pursuit of Perseus is personal for him now. What about the rest of the team? They got off Solovetsky before the Soviets could send in forces to investigate. We'll take some time to heal up, then it's back to work. We may have stopped Perseus, but his rats are still nesting all around us, thanks to the help of one of our own. True. We failed to hunt down Robert Aldrich and his domestic network of spies. We may have to go to more extreme measures, like broad domestic surveillance, which of course we're not authorized to do. Not yet. So who's this? What about Europe? We may have saved it from getting blown to Kingdom Come, but it's still stacked with Perseus's agents. There's more we could have done there if we'd had the time. Who's this black guy? And Bell. A codename Black. And who is he? Arctic air. There's the head, doesn't it? Bell, you made two extraordinary sacrifices to stop Perseus. One was without your knowledge. The other, you made that decision in your own accord. I just want you to know that this little thing that's happened with you and me, it was always for the greater good. You're a goddamn hero, you know that, kid? Heroes have to make sacrifices. And that's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. Whoa. Whoa. So he was the bad guy. <laughs> well, that was interesting. That was interesting. I think the guys at Raven, you know, this, uh, worked on this uh campaign awesome stuff man i liked it i was not expecting that ending but you know very good stuff awesome you know gotta love campaigns gotta love call of duty and uh thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed this series and i really appreciate you know all of you guys coming out and supporting the videos and just hang out with me and, and what we play this so like i said thanks for watching hope you guys enjoy it and i'll see you guys on the next videos if, if you haven't uh subscribed to my channel and i'll see you guys on the next video right later